Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Assalamu alaikum. Today we'll be diving into Al-Mujib. Al-Mujib is the one who responds to all the prayers and the needs of his servants. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is closer to his creatures than they are to themselves. His proximity to all his creatures is the same. He is not any closer to a saint than he is to you or to a mustard seed. He knows all the needs of his creation before they arise and provides their satisfaction even before it is needed. So the manifestation of Al-Mujib in human beings is our attentiveness and responsiveness above all to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. The one who created us and furnished uh, all our needs. We respond to Allah by glorifying Him and by begging for our needs from Him, by attending to our duties prescribed by Him and by responding to the needs of His other creatures when Allah chooses to give to them through your hands. So who is Abdul Majid? Abdul Majib is the one who obeys Allah's call when he hears. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala in Surah Ahkaw, Ayat 31 says, O oh people, accept the inviter to Allah and believe in him. As he accepts Allah's call, Allah accepts his call. That is when his attribute, Al-Mujib, the responder, is expressed in his servant. When Abdul Mujib calls, all come. Since he has responded to Allah, everyone responds to him. Allah confirms this in Surah Baqarah, Ayat 186. And when my servants ask thee concerning me, surely I am near. I answer their prayer of the supplicant when he calls upon me. So should they hear my call and believe in me that they may walk in the right way. Prayer is the generator of energy. If one learns how to use it, one will discover a treasure and a source of strength. If a person recites Ya Muji 55 times after pra after the private prayers, especially at sunrise, his or her needs will be met. The recitation of this name helps to stop gossip and slander directed against oneself. Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.